Hi guys and welcome back to another video here on my channel. Today I'm going to be doing an updated what's in my bag video. The current bag that I have is this Brahmin Duxbury Satchel and this is the bag. This is just how it looks. It comes with a shoulder strap and it comes with two hand straps like this. And it's in this pink color. It's like a dusty rose pink color. I really, really like it a lot. I was wanting to have more of a grown woman bag. And I consider this my grown woman bag. So, I like it a lot. And I'm not going to ramble about it. We're just going to get right into seeing what's in my bag. Okay, so generally I would keep my phone here in this type of pocket. Because it's really easy access to get to. So my phone would be here. I'm going to go ahead and take that out. I'm going to go into the inside. So inside is just one big compartment and then we have two pockets on the side and one zip pouch. So one zip pouch here and I'm going to start in the zipper. I like to work my way inside out. So. Inside the zipper, I have a name badge for work, a stylus for my phone, it's just a, yeah, this is only a stylus, not even a pen, so a stylus for my phone, I have an old sucker piece of candy that's in my purse, um, Oh, it's so random. This is like my random pocket. So I have a pen, uh, a watch. <laughs> so sometimes when I'm out, my watch may start to get on my nerve or I think this one kept coming on class on me. So I'll take it off and I'll just stick it in my purse. So I have my watch which doesn't need to be in there because it may get broke like my beats did. I kept my beats in my purse and they broke one day, so it's not good to keep nice things like that in your purse. So on top of that, I have like this little, I don't know, what is this called? Travel size maybe? But like a purse size um, perfume and this is just the Rebel Fleur by Rihanna. And then last thing in that pocket is my work keys. I have just this little keychain for my work that compartment of my purse is completely empty so I just move along to the big open space and in there I have first a checkbook so it's just a plain checkbook then I have what is just this Dooney and Burt it's from my other purse that I have I just keep it in whatever purse I have honestly and it just has like um, rewards cards and someone's business card in there. So this is just a pouch. I keep extra cards so my wallet won't be stuffed. So that's in there. I have a comb. I don't know why because there's no need to comb my hair the way it is. And I have one of these really huge like scrunchies for your hair. I have a one of those Bath and Body Works sanit hand sanitizer holders, pocket back holders that is still have the tag on it. I've never even taken it off. I just have that in there. Then I have a travel size deodorant. So, you know, you need that when you're out and about. You want to smell fresh. That's in there. Then I have... So I have some Aleve, if I have any pain, I have my pain medicine always, I always have my pain medicine with me, always. And then I have one of these EOS lip balms, and some Tic Tacs that's like, dang they're gone, but a few Tic Tacs, can't go wrong with having those either. Okay. What else? So we have car keys. So this is just my car key and I bought this new hand sanitizer um, holder 
And I hate what it says. It says selfie on it. That's just, it's not me. I don't want anything that says hashtag selfie. But at the end of the day, it has a mirror. So I had to be really, really, really like weigh my, I had to weigh my options and say, wait, do I want something that says selfie? Even though it's annoying, but it's very functional because it's a mirror. And I'm always out wanting to know, like, is my lipstick crack when I'm eating or whatever. So, bam, have a mirror. I can check it really quickly. Car keys, this little fluffy ball that looks like it's been through the works. But, you know, it's still cute. And this one I like so much because it has an L on it for my last name. So, it's an L and a little fluff ball. So, those are in there. That's there. And then next I pull out a planner, which is another thing that is a must for me. I always have some sort of planner in my purse. And this is just a regular old planner. Does me well. So the next thing in my big compartment is my wallet. This is the same wallet I had in my last video. I've had this wallet for, I think, going on four years now. And it's just done me well. Like, I don't even want to get a new one because it's so well broken in. And I don't have any issues out of it. Nothing is broke on it. It's just a plain old wallet. It's nice. I'm not going to go through this. So, same thing. And then the last item that I have in my open compartment is my makeup bag which is this little bag here and this bag is too cute it was a ipsy bag that was gifted to me and I just think it's so pretty so I took the ipsy products out put them in my makeup collection and I just put my my makeup in here so currently in here I have literally just a family of lipsticks honestly like mostly is lippies because if you ever catch me one thing I have for sure is different options when it comes to lips because for the most part how I look right now this is how I look Monday through Friday if not even more plain face than this but I don't do anything like any eyeshadow I may fill in my eyebrows before I leave my house but I will um, put mascara on in the car and then I'll just slap a lip color on before I walk into work. So that's my little trick to make myself look like I'm made up, but I'm not really made up. So I have many, 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 many options of different lip colors in my purse. On to those two compartments there. It's the last thing I have in my bag. And all this in here is, one is a pen. Another pen. And then I have some bobby pins. So if I ever need to pin my hair up while I'm out, I have bobby pins in there. And then in this other compartment, what do I have? I have, oh, this don't need to be in here. That's going to make my purse dirty. But for the most part, I have just this old, older, oh, this is still good. I had it really folded tight, so I'm going to try it. But it's a Belvita breakfast, the breakfast biscuit. Now, these are called Belvita breakfast biscuits. These are really good. And they've been in my purse. Thanks, so good. I never eat all four of these, so I end up eating like one or two, and then I always fold the other ones up to keep for later. So I always have something to snack on if I'm out and I don't have enough food, so that's it. That's what's in my bag. I hope that you guys enjoyed this video, and I hope that you learned some things that maybe you want to start keeping in your bag or maybe you even figured out what your next bag will be that you're going to purchase so however i hope that you guys enjoyed the video and if you would like to stay in touch with me please hit the subscribe button above and also hit the bell for notifications so that anytime i post new videos you won't be missing out and i will be happy to see you guys in my next video
Bye.